Princess of Monkey 1000, and yes, you see my mom is not here. Um, this is take two. <laughs> I forgot to turn the mic on. So anyways, um, my mom is here. She's in her bedroom sleeping. She's not feeling good today. So I had to take her to the ER last night because she has a urine infection, and she had, she needs to have, um, antibiotics through an IV because the pills aren't helping her. She She's throwing them up with her other issue. So um, I was trying to get somebody to come in the home to do it and they brought all the supplies but they couldn't get a nurse to come in and administer the IVs. So um, not ever, not all home care facilities will allow their nurses to put IVs in them at their home which is ridiculous beyond me. Why? I don't know. And so um, my primary doctor for her um, kept calling people, and I guess I finally found one at 8.30 last night, but I was always, always already in the ER with her. And they gave her a bag, and they gave her antibiotics by IV last night, and they sent her home. And we did find a nurse that's coming this afternoon, thank goodness, to finish the antibiotics. That is Shea Bear outside doing a video. So, um, yeah, so that's a good thing. Um, you know, it was, it was a mess yesterday trying to get all this done. And she, I don't want her getting any sicker than what she is. So, um, no, we don't want her going septic. So, um, so I'm glad they're coming. Anyways, we're going to do this Timu haul. I have two bags, but it's the same order. I got this a couple of days ago, and this one just came yesterday, so I'm going to open these up with you guys, and yeah, we'll get into this right now. Okay, guys, we're back, so I'm going to bring you guys down a bit so you guys can see the bags. I did open this one, just slid it just a few minutes ago to help you guys, so I'm going to bring it down a little bit. Hopefully, you guys can see pretty good. Sorry about that. Okay. So, um, yeah, so the first thing I have in here, hmm, I hope I'm not going to be disappointed. This is, it's called the Anti-Snoring Stress Sleep. It's 10 pieces and it's a bags. I do have a snoring problem, but so does Shea Bear. I guess it's part of getting older, um, but I thought these might be cool. I just Shea Bear outside, guys. You'll hear the ring going off. I'm sorry. Um, it It's snoring stickers. You heat your snored, make you sleep more peacefully. So, I don't know if I'll be able to do these right away. I'm going to have to wait because I am on um, relaxers that I just started yesterday for my neck at uh, night time. So... I don't want to put two of them together and be zonked all the time. So I might have to wait until I'm off of those. But this is what the bag looks like here. I'll take one out so you guys can see. There's the directions and stuff. Um, yeah, I don't know if it will work, but it sounded interesting. You get 10 pieces in here. I paid two, $2.98 for these. I don't know if it's a gimmick or not. I, I have no idea. Well, we'll have to find out, but... Like I said, I might not be able to do it until after I get this. So, this is what they look like right here. Oh, you can smell. You can smell it. And on the back, it has, you know, tape. You, you take it off. Oh, I guess it has two. This is sticky right here. And then you have that, and you take that off. And what you do, I can't read that. I guess you put it around your nose so you can um, see if I can get it up. Sometimes you just can't get these up like you want. It's crazy stuff here. Let's see. Yeah, it might be out. Sometimes when they do that, it, it's out and you can't get it. But I was going to show you the video of it. Let's see if I can... Get that off my phone. And there we go. That'll quiet my phone down so you won't hear it off the phone, but you will still hear it. Um, 
Yeah, it's just, I don't know why, but it's a snoring stress care patch. So I guess you put it over your nose to help you um, stop snoring. Oh, there it is. Okay, I got it. And you, it says good deep sleep, no longer breathe, breathed by snoring, bothered by snoring. Sorry, you can't really read it too well. Do you have such troubles? It says effective treatment of snoring, safe and non-irritating quality assurance, no harm to the skin. So this is, this is what it looks like on here. And, um, I thought it was interesting. Oh, you put it down by your throat down here. That's how you do it. it you can't, it does have some kind of directions probably on the back, but I can't, I can't see it. I'd have to put it underneath my magnifying glass, which I don't have at the moment. So that's it right there. So you guys know, and you just put it on your throat there, and it's supposed to help. I'll have to try it out. I mean, three ninety eight. What the heck, right? <coughs> Sorry. So, anyways, and I, yeah, it was two ninety eight for me. It's three ninety eight right now. So that's what it looks like. There you go. Hopefully it works. I'll let you know. Um, I'll have to wait a bit before I can try these. I might try them on Shea Bear. Maybe we could do that. I'll just put it there when he's sleeping and see if he'll, he'll stop his snoring. He gets mad because he doesn't like snoring. And, so, and, and then he'll, he'll get mad at me for snoring and wake me up, but I don't wake him up because I know that he has a hard time sleeping. So I, I, I let him be. You know, he's like, you need to wake me up when I snore. I don't like that. So how do you care? What do you care? You're sleeping. <laughs> so anyways, I got that. Okay, the next thing I got were these lovely doodads, which are smaller than I thought, which kind of disappointed a little bit. I got solar wall lamps. Now, what I was thinking for these, and they're going to be way too small, but I could put them out back on my, beside my doors. I want to put these, I want to get lights that I can put on each side of the garage because my house does not have them. So it's solar interaction wall lamp. So, and they're solar and, you know, so I thought that would be nice to put on each side of the garage and, um, you know, and it would light it up a little bit better at night. So here's what it looks like. There we go. And it's got a little film here that you take off the solar. So, and it gives you some screws here if you need to use the screws. So it also, no, it's just screws. It's very, very plasticky. I mean, you know, it's outside. And it says it's for garage, patio, um, home, and garden. So, I mean, they might work, but they're awful small. I would have liked them a little bit bigger, you know, um, for the garage. But I'll look at it and see. Get Shea Bear maybe to put them up, and I'll, I'll show you when I get them up. Um, I, maybe just for demonstration purposes. <laughs> because I don't want to put these up yet until I get the house painted. And I won't be doing that until my roof is done. Which is hopefully going to happen probably next month, I'm thinking. It, it's going to happen. I'm keeping my fingers crossed. I haven't been too excited yet because it's a program. And I, I have been approved, but um, they brought out contractors, and what they do is they have to bid on the house, and whoever is usually the lowest bid is the one who gets it, they said. And then they give me a call. Um, they came out, and then there was one guy came out afterwards, and he, he did 
the house by himself and then he said well most of the time they call him last for whatever reason I don't know and then um, I guess maybe he hasn't put his bid in yet or they haven't revised it and got it through the supervisor done yet I haven't caught I haven't heard from him yet but I, I'm hoping to hear from him soon so I got two of these so and the price is 408 now and let me see what I paid. I paid three seventy eight for these each. So, I mean, these would probably be cute on my back door on each side. That would be cute. But I will find a place for them if I don't like it beside the garage. Because I really wanted something a little bit bigger. Um, yeah. But, I mean, what do you expect? It's, you know... For the price is not bad okay so now I got my other one here and I'll do it this way so now these all came on the same order just in different packages why they do that sometimes I think it's because it's I think they think this was liquid I don't know if it leaks or something. They don't want it to leak. And that's a look, kind of, they consider that electronic, the solar thing. I don't know. So they put them, those two, to separate for whatever reason. I don't know. So this one here, the big one is on the top. So I will get it up and show y'all. Hmm, I thought this was going to be soft. This is cute. Ooh. Kind of got bent. This is, uh... A double hand woven rat and wicker um, tray. I paid seven dollars and twenty five cents for this. Let me see if it's the same. If I can get it up, it is four forty one. But it depends on the size. You pick the size selection, and this is a medium. So. I think it's a medium. Maybe this is large. No, the large is thirteen ninety seven, and uh, let's see, what's the medium? The medium in the now is five forty three. It's on a lightning bolt, lightning deal, and um, it comes in red and blue, and they do have small too. I, I so this is the medium one that I got. I didn't want it too big, but I didn't want it too small. So, <laughs> I think I could have went large, and I would have been fine. Yeah, it's for my coffee table. I wanted something a little bit nicer than the little tray that I have there. I might put some um, candles in here. I, I don't know. Um, you know, put a couple of candles in there and just decorate a little bit. I think it's very nice. It did get bent a little bit from shipping, but you can move this up a little bit. I wouldn't move them up too much, depending on how you want them, I guess. You want them completely straight, and they show in the picture they're completely straight. So, yeah, see, this one's moving. So, otherwise, it looks pretty good. It's nice. It's solid. The wood on the bottom with the decoration there, and it was, yeah. So, um, I thought this was cute. Very cute. Um, yeah. So, we'll put this on the coffee table. And, um, yeah, that'll be cute. I believe I got price adjustment on this one. I think I did a couple of them. Um... But I don't know. I've seen more information. Let's see if I can find. Yeah. Oh, I got price adjustment on it. Yes, I did. It was uh, $2.03 that I got back on it. So that's okay. That's pretty good. So I got that. And the next thing I got is for my camera. My camera, this is a Tesselin GoPro chest quick release magnet, so I can put it on my chest. So maybe if I go walking, which I keep saying I'm going to do, I never do it, or I go fishing, I want my hands free, and I don't want to use the tripod, 
I can use this on my camera. I, I think this is, will be fun to use. It's a magnetic pen, pendant mount, mount. So that's what it looks like. It gives you a little pamphlet in here. Um, yeah. I don't know how they think people are supposed to read that. Good luck on that. Yeah, right? And there's something on the back. So whatever it says, yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, and it comes in like this. And it gives you rope because it can go around your neck. This piece goes around your neck. Oh, quite a magnet. How, there you go. So you're going to put this piece around your neck. And my camera that I'm using right now that I can't use, you take this out right here. And you put your camera through that. And then you lock it in. And then you will put the magnet on there. Ooh, that's a good magnet. And this is to go around your neck. So it doesn't really... This is adjustable, so hopefully I can get it longer <laughs> to go over my head. There, there we go. Oops, sorry guys, I hit the mic. I'll show it to you. There you go. And my camera would be there and I can walk around and I have my hands free. Fish, you guys can see me in a different view. I think this will be fun to use. And I'm not having to, I don't like the ones that really go to your shirt. Um, Shaber's got one, and it's good for him, but if you've got girls, you know, you don't want that because when you bend over, it's just going to, so I don't want, I figured this might work a little bit better. Hopefully it will be just fine. Because once you put it underneath your shirt and you put that magnet on top, it's going to keep it secure. So it'll be fine. So it's 764 right now. Let me see what I paid for it. Um, let me see what I paid for it. I did have a price adjustment on it. I got $1.64 back and let me see what I paid for it. Uh, I paid $8.48 for it. So not too bad. I think this will be good. A good quality. Nice rope. Adjustable. So it goes over your head. I think that will be fun to use. And whatever this is, I have no idea. What the heck is that? I don't know what that is. It comes with it. Hmm, let me see what this is. Huh. I don't know. Oh, it looks like it's like a ring and it snaps. I don't know. I have to figure this one, this piece out. Um, let's see if I can see the uh, where this goes. Doesn't really say. Hmm. I'll have to ask Shea Bear. Maybe he'll know what it is. Yeah. Because it's not really showing. This piece. Maybe that's a fishing thing? I don't know. But it has a ring on here. And it looks like you can. Like spread it apart somehow. Hmm. I don't know. And it doesn't say anything about it. So I'm sure it was just a maybe an extra thing that came with it. I don't know. I don't know. That's strange, isn't it? You would think it would show it because it's in the bag. I mean, I don't think it has anything to do with the rope part. No, because this doesn't come off or anything. So I don't know. Maybe a safety thing? So if it fell... I have no idea what this is. If anybody knows, let me know. I'll ask Shaver, but he's outside doing his video right now, so I can't. So if I find out, I will. I'll let y'all know for sure. Okay, next thing I got was some. This is some 
black castor oil. It's from Jamaica, Jamaican black castor oil. Strengthen of soft, soften condition and shampoo. I wanted to see if it would work on my hair, how it would be. Yeah. It has shea but butter and peppermint and apple cider vinegar. Natural, chemically processed, or heat styled hair. Sulfate free and color safe. Very nice. So I wanted to try this out. See what it was like. And you get two bottles. I think one is, well, one's a conditioner and one's a shampoo. I'll bring them out so you can see them. Uh, this is, this is the conditioner. There you go. And there's the instructions on the back. Oop, or is there? Um, just manufacturing an origin made in China and yeah, nothing really great on the back. So it's just pretty, doesn't say how long you keep it on. Um, no, I will have to see on the box if it says anything. It's the same on the bottle, what's on the box, uh, on the back of the box. It does have directions. Conditioner applied generously to wet hair after shampooing. Leave on three to five minutes. Rinse to the hair thoroughly. For the shampoo, it says apply shampoo to wet hair, gently massage, and rinse. Sh shelf life, it's three years on this. So, there you go. So, I thought I'd try this. I'll let you know how I like it. Maybe it will help my hair, and maybe not. We will see. I did get a price adjustment of it. I paid $6.48 for it. Um, and the price adjustment I got, it was $0.68 cents on there. So that's not too bad. So hopefully it'll work. Make my hair smell. Oh, let, let me smell it. Oh, it has a nice. Oh, that's nice. Very nice. That's the shampoo I smelled. Now let's smell the conditioner. Oh, yeah. Very lovely. That was really nice. I hope I like this. If I do, I'll be buying more. Someone was yes. at your front door. Okay, guys. So... I got that, and I got one more thing, I think, in here. And this is a top that I got. I've had this in my basket for a while. Yeah, this is all scrunched up. I usually get them pretty nice. I don't usually get them all scrunched up, like thrown right into the bag. This is cute. I thought this was cute, and it would go with my shorts, you know, my jeans or whatever. And I thought that was cute. Very nice. Oh, I like it. Nice stretchiness to it. Yeah. And then it has this on the bottom. On the bottom here. So hopefully you guys can see that. Yeah, there you go. So I paid $6.77 for this. This is a size 3 extra large, which is an 18. Um, yeah, it has a tag in here. It's 100% polyester. It says wash with light cold. And I usually mo use cold water. So it should be okay. Um, yeah. So. Um, yeah, it'll be fine. So I think this is cute. I hope it's not going to be too big. Because it does have a long arm here. And I don't want my bra showing if it doesn't have to. You know what I mean? So, but I got I paid six seventy seven for. It. I did have three price adjustments on here. My first one was eighty four cents. My second one was a dollar sixty four, and the other one was two dollars and three cents. So that was pretty good. So yeah. So anyways, it's nice and soft. Very nice. Doesn't feel like polyester at all. This feels like cotton. Yeah, really does. Hmm. So, that's what I got, guys, for this order. The only thing I am, I was disappointed on the size, but at the same time, I only got the medium. I wish I got the large on that. So, that could be my fault, you know, but, I mean, these pictures are 
are somewhat misleading because they are bigger than what you think. But this is going to look cute on my deck, on my coffee table. It'll look really cute. So, and the other thing, I'm really kind of disappointed that I thought they would be, be bigger. I really did. Um, not huge, but I expected it probably a little bit bigger than this. But we'll see if they look good over there. Um, if they don't, I'm going to use them on the back door over here that I have to go in the backyard. I could put one on each side, and that would look cute. So... Yeah, you always forget to, to decorate the backyard. And I'm like, you know, I need to do stuff for my backyard a little bit better. So, anyways, guys, that's it for now. Um, I'm going to start my next one that I have going. And so stay tuned because I'll be doing them back-to-back -back when I edit them. I'll put one up and then I'll put the other one up for you all. So you have two to watch instead of one. And, yeah, so... I'm going to say goodbye for now. Monkey says she's out. And on to the next Timu haul. Bye, y'all.